Hello, this is Hakadabina, and today we are going to be reading about the Electroscape, another enigmatic level of the back rooms. If you like this, this video, please leave, leave a like on the video, comment down below, and subscribe to the channel. Now let's get right into this. Survival difficulty is a class 3. It is unsafe, unsecure, and has a low entity count. The Electroscape is an enigmatic level of the back rooms. Description: This level also resembles an infinite empty office building. What's seemingly strange about it is that the ceiling has holes with cables and wires hanging from every one of them. This level has the strongest Wi-Fi in the back rooms so far, but it is not recommended to go here. The cables are at first not dangerous. There are some rooms flooded with almond water, which is electrified by the uh, wires. This area is extremely dangerous. It is not recommended unless using to offer protection. Some rooms have furniture, but it is very rare. Rarely, the lights will start brightening to extreme levels of light that is blinding until the lights blow out. Once this event happens, everything goes dark. Goes dark. This effect can also happen to flashlights and any other electric or battery-powered light sources and devices for communications and, and like speakers and cell phones. Although they will be taken out by this, it is not permanent. The lights also have the maximum hum buzz noise, as like in level 0 and level 1. Sometimes you may hear strange music like tones emitted from the electricity, and this can react and follow songs being played by, in, by an electrical device. The electroscape is rumored to be one of the main sources of electric power in the back rooms, similar to level 3. Sometimes, out of your communication devices, you might hear words be spoken by the cables and wires themselves. So the cables might be their own entity. There are normal entities that can and spawn seem to be the hounds. Unless you count the wires. There is another special entity on here known as the Electrosphere. The Electrosphere. This entity is a humanoid figure that appears as soon as we are able to speak. This entity has a skeletal body with bones showing through and is burnt. It is completely covered in cables with white glowing eyes. It also has a large smile with electricity flowing out of it. He seems to have the ability to emit electricity and attack wanderers with this ability. This entity also seems to be able to turn into an electric bolt and is able to travel through the cables and wires. It speaks out of strange tones and high pitched and aggressive voice, and will tell you to get out and instantly attack you. This, the entity seems to be afraid of survivors wearing electricity protection suits and will usually flee if, if it sees one. Bases, Outposts, and Communities it is not entirely impossible to make a group here, although none have been made. The reverse of a group or sometimes even two groups living here. Entrances and exits. Entrances. To enter, you must find a maintenance floor in level 3. In there, there will be a computer and a few cables on the ground, unplugged. And once you connect them, and once you exit, you will be in the electroscape. It seems this room will randomly appear and disappear throughout level 3. And there are rumors that the wires of level 3 lead to the electroscape. Exit. To exit, you must wander around. And if wearing protection, the flood areas will lead to level negative 2. There is also a flight of stairs that will lead to level 4 or level 13. There is also rumors of level 25 being accessible from this level, but this is unknown. And that was the... Electroscape, my bad. If you like this video, please leave a like on the video, comment down below, and subscribe to the channel. Who knows what I'm going to be doing tomorrow, but until then, goodbye!